Rain, rain, go away. I'm sure the fans are saying to themselves it has been raining for most of the day here at the home of Manchester City. I'm Derek Ray, and with me here on the commentary position is Lee Dixon. And we've got Champions League group stage action to look forward to. It is Manchester City facing RB Leipzig. Yeah, the long road to the final starts here in game one. Always think that you win your home games and don't lose your away games. You've got a good chance of progressing. City did lift the European trophy, the Cup Winners' Cup, back in 1970. You grew up watching them, Lee, but that would have been just before your time, I think. Yeah, only just, though. I missed that one. Um, but it's nice to see them now playing at a higher level and producing European football that we're all proud of. And certainly got my Manchester City supporters cap on, but well, it's in the cupboard anyway. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Ilkay Gundogan in central midfield. And they line up tonight with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. And you tend to know what you're going to get tactically from this team. High pressing. Well, high pressing, high energy. I played this system at Arsenal many a year under George Graham. It doesn't half work when it works well. Sometimes you can just get exposed to the back, but they've got it down to a tee, to be fair. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage, match day one, underway. Gundogan. The tackle crisp and accurate. Maneuvering his way forward. And now Kevin De Bruyne. Joao Cancelo. Gabriel Jesus. Now, what can he do here? It's a cross towards the near post. Thumped clear. And it's come off the keeper. Walker now. Given away by City. Emil Forsberg Paulsen he might be able to profit from the wide position Laporte Gabriel Jesus it's with Gundogan and here's Rodri Kevin Camper Emil Forsberg they've given it away A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. It's with Bernardo Silva. Joao Cancelo. An abundance of space. Fine cross into the middle. An easy meet for the keeper, given that cross. Walker now. Gabriel Jesus. An awful lot of green space to run into. Well, a sloppy clearance. What can the opposition do with this? Kevin Camper. Nordi Mukieli. Danny Olmo with it. Well, let's see. Does he mean business? He's been a bit unlucky. And Camper. 
Danny Olmo. Well, the cross that time completely overcooked. Delivered into the area here. But he had a decent reading of that ball in. Kevin Kumpel. Well, let's see what he has in store for them. And Forsberg. He has been deemed to be offside. Not by Muchley. Brilliant, brilliant officiating, that is. Look at that. Spot on. It's with Joao Cancelo. It's with Gundogan. The referee has decided to give the free-kick decision the way of City. He's now got to be extra careful. A verbal warning rather than a caution here. Yeah, the next one, he knows where he's going. In the book. going short with it and he's setting the table for his team staunch rear guard action excellent refereeing advantage in operation Mukiele Kevin Kumpel Angelino Forsberg well that's very smart defending and now they have the ball again Gabriel Jesus now Gundogan and Gundogan is he going to punish them here the ball with Kampel Emil Forsberg will there be a tangible end product Angelino the referee has indicated crossing opportunity can he make this move count well that is how to run at defenders well the post getting in the way there should he really have taken on the shot from that acute angle Lee you judge by your play on the pitch and some of that play is decision making and he made a poor decision there and so the half time whistle is sounded here in Manchester It's the opening match day, Champions League group stage. Into the second half then, and these two sides are locked together. Just can't really choose between them at the moment. And dispossessed. We have the sixth sense to know what to do and win it back. Carrying a genuine threat here. Edison, routine save. It's with Gundogan. And Gabriel Jesus. Now, what could he do here? Well, it was straight up the keeper, but technically good goalkeeping. Powerson. Nogdi Mukiele. A City free kick forthcoming. De Bruyne now. Gundogan. Gundogan threading it through. And Bernardo Silva has it. Gundogan. He's just a thorough reader of the game. And there we saw it. Well, let's see, does he mean business? And no-nonsense defensive clearance. Corner for Manchester City. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Hello. 
So the corner played into the box. I don't think in the grand scheme of things, he's going to be terribly proud of that head of attempt. Well, heading practice and training next week, that was pretty average, to be fair. In possession, Yusuf Paulsen. Well, let's see what he has in store for them. Maneuvering his way forward. Is he going to punish them here? Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. And Gundogan. And attempting the through ball. It's Bernardo Silva. And it is the opening goal of the contest. Well, it was always going to be a tight game, but now all of a sudden, one team ahead. Things have got to change on both sides. Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. Once again, Manchester City with the advantage. Klosterman. The ball with Kampel. In possession, Yusuf Paulsen. Beautifully timed. Grealish. And now Kevin De Bruyne. Danny Olmo. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. Others to play it to. Oh, goal behind Derek, and he's missed. It's a big miss. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. And in the second half, the signs are positive. They can't relax, Lee, but they ought to be pleased. Well, all the City players will be looking up at the clock. Time is ebbing away. They have such a delicate lead. Will they rue those missed chances? They could be costly. In possession, Yusuf Paulsen. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Ten minutes left for play in this match. It's with Bernardo Silva. And now with Angelino. Marcel Zabitza. An awful lot of green space to run into. Moving through the gears. Electing to cross into the centre. Oh dear, I think he's left his shooting boots behind in the dressing room. Well, it was well worth the effort. Poor technique, really. Should do better than that. Can they cut up on the defence with a through ball? Everson in goal made it look easy. Given away by City. Running towards goal. One man to beat. And disappointingly, he got completely underneath that. Well, here's a coaching tip. Long-range shot, lean back equals over the bar. I always listen to your coaching tips, Lee. <laughs> and just the one minute left in normal time here. The, fourth official is the referee's verdict is three additional minutes. And Manchester City moving the ball with purpose. Orban. And full time it is. Manchester City pick up all three points in this their initial game of the Champions League season. Yeah, really, really strong start. That's what you need. But with five games to go, very important you stay in the now. One game at a time, Derek. Bit of a cliche.
And the shining light this evening, no doubt about it, Bernardo Silva. He's always a man to watch for the opposition, but they couldn't keep tabs on him in that vital moment when he grabbed that goal.